Hi guys, short video because you are all dying for an update of course of this graph. Um, I made a video in July, uh, the 3rd of July or so, uh, with this graph. And at that point in time, uh, the title of the video was um, uh, Cryptos 83% overvalued but could go to 700%. And uh, that was right about here at this point. Um, after that it went sideways, uh, but um, on an upward, still upwards, so the total market cap. Uh, Bitcoin went uh, up actually the past three months then, and then uh, altcoins went sideways, but that results in it continuing to go up the market cap. Uh, and then, um, it was probably around 150 billion then here, uh, uh, about that, no, it was about 120 billion, and now we're at 280 billion, uh, so, so the past um, uh, five months it has more than doubled again. And, and the question of course for me is also how high are we overvalued here uh, compared to the average uh, growth rate, the purple line, uh, um, well right now it's 230. 33%. I have not uh, plotted the graph myself because uh, Trollolo makes this graph but he hasn't done an update uh, and so what I did is I drew the line myself in Photoshop uh, by estimate. Uh, it's not 100% uh, correct but it's by estimate correct. Uh, the 230% is also around by estimate right now. You can calculate that from Trollolo. The average uh, price of all coins uh, is 83 billion eh? so we're at 280 billion so that's about um, um, 3.3 uh, times higher uh, current market cap and so that means it's about 230% times higher and I find this uh, very interesting um, uh, because uh, well um, uh, I do think uh, still the same as in previous video we will likely get a period of overvaluation here in 2017 and 2018 um, and so it can go to these kind of peaks uh, that was 1300% 1000% so I think we could go maybe to 700-800% above the purple line and so right now we're 80 billion over 2018 probably go towards 100 billion and then you go uh, 7 let's say 800% higher so that's a peak of uh, times nine, so about 900 billion. So I think we will get close to 1 trillion over the next year. And we're now at 280 billion, so it's again times three huh? over the next, maybe it's not the next year, then maybe the next two years, but yeah, I'm still very bullish uh, on uh, on this whole thing. Um, uh, but I think this is a, an area of concern <laughs> for uh, the investors here because uh, it has been going up quite well. Eh? Uh, it may go a bit higher here, but it is also possible we get in the meantime a, a very good correction here. You see, it went to almost hit the purple line eh? in 2013 and that was eh, 2013 we had basically two bubbles. Eh? The first one from about $10 to $255 for Bitcoin corrected to $50 eh? and then back to a bit sideways a bit and then from basically $100 to $1,000. Hundred dollars. So this was a two move ways movement. I think we can certainly have this also. Huh? So 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 that's why I, I've been selling some um, crypto for fiat. Uh, hopefully I can buy back when it goes near the purple line again, and so that's near hundred billion. Huh? Um, uh, and I think um, the odds are still there for that to happen. Huh? Um, I mean. Uh, Many people are extremely bullish. All the bears are gone now, me included. So, 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 uh, uh, people are doubling down on the way up. So, so a panic crash is certainly possible. Um, but I think it will come. We now have the altcoin bubble starting uh, after Bitcoin has gone up a lot. It continues to go up. Bitcoin new all-time high today of nine thousand dollars. But. Um, but the altcoins are starting to pick up uh, strongly, Ethereum, uh, Bitcoin Cash, uh, the, the top coins are leading, but I think the next step is that the mid-cap coins also are starting to go up a lot uh, versus Bitcoin even. So, so, so um, uh, yeah, 
look this sideways movement here we also saw this here a little bit eh? and then a next big, big pump and so it, it can go also just straight up here eh? another big pump and we get this uh, 800 billion 900 billion market cap well the next few months eh? next two months that's possible eh? and only then we get a serious correction eh? or we can get first a serious correction and then it can do that and so that's hard to tell you can't know that uh, but these are yeah uh, the risk reward ratios of crypto in general and so i think short term it's not great uh, but long term and I'm, i mean over one two months can go either way i uh, can go up a lot down a lot but uh but but in the longer term one to two years it is still looking very good um and so that's why i still have a majority in crypto um yeah so yeah uh, i hope uh, this was uh, interesting to you guys i'm keeping it short uh, i will do uh, another video soon just about my own portfolio and the moves i've been making um i wish you all a great uh, day and thanks so much for watching bye